This video is on infrastructure as code. These days, you can use infrastructure as code to provision and manage IT resources via machine readable definition files. There are two methods, push and pull. With the pull method, the server pulls its configuration from controlling server, while controlling server with the push method pushes the configuration to the destination. Simply put, engineers can provision and manage IT infrastructure at scale using code-based approach rather than manually configuring each virtualization instance. And with infrastructure automation, faster execution is possible, as is increased visibility that can help other teams across enterprise work quickly and more efficiently. The automation also removes human error, thus decreasing downtime and increasing reliability. And these outcomes can help the enterprise implement DevOps culture, combining development and operations. Complementing this, we have orchestration which allows infrastructure as code to be arranged or coordinated across multiple systems, allowing a distributed application or set of services to span multiple machines. Infrastructure as code is the most useful for developers. You can simply create an environment for multiple purposes like researching, development, testing, and such.